So since we've got that conversion, let's pretend we had a problem that said, how many inches is something if it's 24.2 centimeters long? Okay, so let's do that problem. Okay, so it's in the problem, it gives us the length in centimeters as, what did I say, 24.2? 24.2 centimeters. Hopefully that's what I said. Okay, 24.2 centimeters. And recall when we have something like this, we can make it a fraction, right? Canceling out the undesired unit, giving us the desired unit. Is everybody clear on doing that, right? So help me out, what would I do? Multiply this, right, by something, a fraction. What would I put on the bus? Centimeters. Okay, units of centimeters, but 2.54, right? Yeah. And at the top, one inch, right? That'll cancel out my centimeters, giving me inches. Is everybody clear on that? Okay. So let's just do that together. So 24.2 divided by 2.54. And to three sig figs, of course, 9.53 inches. Everybody can do something like that, right? Okay, good. So that's a conversion factor. Conversion factors that we've learned from previous. So when something equals something else, you can make it a ratio and convert one unit to another with it. Is everybody clear on what I'm saying? Okay, good.